Cullen? Wrong watch guard reporting. It's a massive force, the bulk over the mountain. Under what banner? None. None? I can't come in unless you open. I'm Cole. I came to warn you, to help. People are coming to hurt you. You probably already know. What is this? What's going on? The Templars come to kill you. Templars? Is this the Order's response to our talks with the Mages, attacking blindly? The Red Templars went to the Elder One. You know him? He knows you. You took his Mages. There. This Elder One? Very angry that you took his mages. Cullen, give me a plan. Anything. Haven is no fortress. If we are to withstand this monster, we must control the battle. Get out there and hit that force. Use everything you can. Mages! You! You have sanctioned to engage them! That is Samson! He will not make it easy! Inquisition! With the Herald! For your life! For all of us! The Chantry is your shelter! He tried to stop a Templar. The blade went deep. He's going to die. What a charming boy! Harold, our position is not good. That dragon stole back any time you might have earned us. I've seen an Archdemon. I was in the Fade, but it looked like that. I don't care what it looks like. It's got a path for that army. They'll kill everyone in Haven. The Elder One doesn't care about the village. He only wants the Herald. If it will save these people, he can have me. It won't. He wants to kill you. No one else matters, but he'll crush them. Kill them anyway. I don't like him. You don't like... <sighs> Harold. There are no tactics to make this survivable. The only thing that slowed them was the avalanche. We could turn the remaining trebuchets, cause one last slide. We are overrun. To hit the enemy, we'd bury Haven. We're dying, but we can decide how. Many don't get that choice. Yes, that. Chancellor Roderick can help. He wants to say it before he dies. There is a path. You wouldn't know it unless you'd made the summer pilgrimage, as I have. The people can escape. She must have shown me. Andraste must have shown me so I could t tell you. What are you on about, Roderick? It was whim that I walked the path. I did not mean to start, it was overgrown. Now, with so many in the Conclave dead, to be the only one who remembers. <laughs> I don't know, Harold. If this simple memory can save us, this could be more than mere accident. You could be more. What about it, Cullen? Will it work? Possibly. If he shows us the path. But what of your escape? Perhaps you will surprise it. Find a way. Inquisition, follow Chancellor Roderick through the Chantry. Move! Herald, if you are meant for this, if the Inquisition is meant for this, I pray for you. They'll load the trebuchets. Keep the Elder One's attention until we're above the tree line. If we are to have a chance, if you are to have a chance, let that thing hear you.
This thing is not a stray puppy you can make into a pet. It has no business being here. Wouldn't you say the same of an apostate? Inquisitor, I wondered if Cole was perhaps a mage, given his unusual abilities. He can cause people to forget him, or even fail entirely to notice him. These are not the abilities of a mage. It seems that Cole is a spirit. It is a demon. If you prefer, although the truth is somewhat more complex. Cole warned us about Corypheus at Haven. He saved a lot of lives. And what will, and what will its help cost? How many lives will this demon later claim? In fact, his nature is not so easily defined. Speak plainly, Solas. What are we dealing with? Demons normally enter this world by possessing something. In their true form, they look bizarre, monstrous. But you claim Cole looks like a young man. Is it possession? No. He has possessed nothing and no one. And yet he appears human in all respects. Cole is unique, Inquisitor. More than that, he wishes to help. I suggest you allow him to do so. What do you mean by possession? Spirits and demons cross over from the Fade by attaching themselves to something in this world. But Cole has willfully manifested in human form without possessing anyone. The demons who came through the breach, or through the rifts, weren't possessing anything. These demons were drawn through against their will, driven mad by this world. But Cole predates the breach. From what we can tell, he has lived here for months, perhaps years. He looks like a young man. For all intents and purposes, he is a young man. It is remarkable. I should hear what Cole has to say for himself. Where is he now? If none of us remember him, he could be anywhere. Haven. So many soldiers fought to protect the pilgrims so they could escape. Choking fear. I can't think from the medicine, but the cuts rack me with every heartbeat. Hot, white, pain. Everything burns. I can't. I can't. I'm going to... I'm dying. I I'm... Dead. You're feeling their pain. It's louder this close, with so many of them. Would you like to go somewhere more comfortable? Yes, but here is where I can help. Every breath slower, like lying in a warm bath, sliding away. Smell of my daughter's hair when I kiss her goodnight. Gone. Cracked brown pain, dry, scraping, thirsty, here. Thank you. It's all right. She won't remember me. You're using your powers as a spirit to help people? Yes. I used to think I was a ghost. I didn't know. I made mistakes, but I made friends, too. Then a Templar proved I wasn't real. I lost my friends. I lost everything. I learned how to be more like what I am. It made me different, but stronger. I can feel more. I can help. If you're willing, the Inquisition could use your help. Yes, helping. I help the hurt, the helpless. There's someone. 
hurts. It hurts. It hurts. Someone make it stop hurting. Make her, please. The healers have done all they can. It will take him hours to die. Every moment will be agony. He wants mercy. Help. You say he won't die for hours yet, but you can't know that for certain. His body is failing. He could recover. Or the healers could find another way to help him. How do you know? I don't, and neither do you. That's part of life. Try. I want to stay. <laughs>